Eddie Howe has admitted Newcastle can't afford to sign £50 million Bournemouth striker Dominic Solanke, and offered no guarantees that major players won't be sold. The Toon head coach says the Geordies don't have any friends in the transfer market willing to loan a player. Howe reacted to Newcastle officials publishing the club's accounts on Thursday, which showed a £73 million loss last year, and the club right up against profit and sustainability rules PSR. He has been linked with Solanke this week, who he signed for Bournemouth for £19 million when boss on the south coast. But Howe said, it is a frustrating story. We have not made an inquiry. I love Dominic and signed him. And rate him highly. We don't have the ability to sign a player of that level. Asked today to give assurances that stars like Bruno Guimaraes, Alexander Isaac or kids like Sean Longstaff won't be sold, Howe said. I can't offer any assurance on that regardless of our FFP situation. You can never tell what will happen in football. Every Premier League club will sell players. Man City have sold some very good players. Their income is the highest of any club. That is the landscape for everyone. We reluctantly sold Alan St. Maximin. In the summer. Currently Newcast have no plans to spend this month. They'd like to loan Man Cities. Calvin Phillips and Howe will push to do something because Joe Linton is the latest player out injured for six weeks. But it's tough going, and Howe admitted, I'm not sure we have many friends in the market. I'm not. Sure there's many clubs out there that are willing to help us currently. To agree to a loan deal, you? Need the club to agree to that deal so we're in that moment. Asked directly about selling a homegrown. Academy player who offer pure profit to help ease their PSR position, how did offer encouragement to local lad Longstaff? He said, the rules are a shame because it shouldn't be that way. Players you invest in and develop shouldn't be the ones you benefit more from selling. Sean has a long-term future here. Hopefully I have demonstrated that with my picking of him in most games I have had the opportunity to. He has become a vital part of my midfield. So yes, we love him and we love Louis and all our academy kids. They have an attachment to the football club that you can only have being local. We desperately don't want to lose that. Joe Linton is out for six weeks and Howe said, it's not good, he will miss a minimum of six weeks. It is a real blow for us. He has had a stop-start season, he has had a few problems and this is a big one. It's a tendon in his quad. It is a difficult place to get an injury. He is disappointed and he wants to play and do well. We have had to do a job of picking him up. No one is immediately coming back and we have no one like Joe Linton. He is our midfield driving force, there is no one like him so it is a big blow. Harvey Barnes is running on grass again and kicking a ball but not close. Jacob Murphy has joined in training on A. Non-contact basis and Callum Wilson could be back for the Aston Villa game. Elliot Anderson is out long-term with a back fracture. But Joe Willock is building up the strength in his Achilles tendon. Newcastle face Manchester City on Saturday night with. How saying Pep Guardiola is the best manager in the world. He added, Man City are the team to beat. Their record has been incredible. They have always timed their run, second half of the season, they have got momentum and been difficult to play against. But we can compete. This link privacy notice.